I thought it would be fun to share with you guys how I do my everyday makeup. I don't tend to wear a ton of makeup, but when I do wear makeup, whether it be for when I'm going into work at school or going into the city, um, this is the makeup look that I usually do. My hair takes up a lot of space, and so I do it really loosely because I don't want to mess up my curls, you know? I usually start with a little bit of a concealer and I just put a little bit underneath my eyes and I just go like this. Just a little, looks like a lot, I promise it's not. And then I just take my middle fingers and go like this. And I just dab it on. I don't use anything to really prime my face because like I'm not doing foundation or anything like that, but after I wake up or get out of the shower, I always put on moisturizer and usually, usually I do two layers um, of moisturizer just because my face is so dry. Now I'm gonna do my brows, even though they're kind of okay already, you know? Um, so I just brush them, my little spoilie. My eyebrows are actually microbladed so most of the time I don't even do them, but it's starting to fade a little bit. So I'll just fix little spots that I want to look a little better. I'm going to go in with some, I think this is bronzer. And then I'm just going to take my little uh, angled brush that I've had for years that I should probably get a new one. And then I just go down on my jawline. This is probably where I spend the most time, despite- Oh no, most time is on my eyelashes, even though they're already long. And then I just go in and I blend! I blend a lot here. I like my cheekbones, so I gotta make them pop, you know? And I blend it up a little bit to my temple and down. Now, if I was having a hairstyle where um, my hair was off my face, I would bring it up to the top of my forehead, but since my hair is gonna be down today, um, there's no reason to put like any extra makeup up there because it's gonna be hidden anyway. And this one too. Sometimes if I'm feeling fancy, even though it doesn't really make a difference, I'll put it on the side of my neck so the contour on my cheeks doesn't look so weird. And then I'm gonna dab a little bit on here and then I squeeze it like so. And then I do a little bit on the bridge of my nose I'm gonna go in with some blush. It was not an expensive blush, but it's very pigmented. So I usually have to blend it out a little bit, but blush is my favorite part. I love blush so much. And so I put this on both the apples of my cheeks and I bring it up a little bit and I also put it on the bridge of my nose. I'm looking cute. You can still see my freckles, which is another reason why I don't wear foundation that much is because I love my freckles. The next step is mascara. Do my little, like a wiggly moves. And I don't worry about getting mascara on my lid because I always do because my lashes are long and I push too hard and this and that. So I just go in with a Q-tip afterwards. And if I feel like they're clumpy, I have a eyelash separator. So usually I go with that. It's my uh, eyelash separator. And I just like slightly comb them. Today they're not as bad, but sometimes they like clump up for no reason. And I just like separating them a little bit. I'm almost done. One of my, my few last steps is I'm gonna take the bronzer contour that I was using earlier and also the blush I was using, eyeshadow brush. So I'm gonna lightly tap on both sides and very lightly tap my blush. And I'm gonna put that a little above my crease just to give some color behind my eyes. My favorite step is my highlight. I tap it on where I want it. Usually I do a little bit on the bridge of my nose and on the tip of my nose. I'll do my cupid's bow. And then 
I do a little bit underneath my eye. I really like the way it looks. It's like my own style thing. I actually can't see, I'm gonna use the mirror in this. I like pulling it underneath, because I like, it's just like gold. Look at me. And I'm also gonna take my finger and put it on my cheekbone. I will also put a little below my eyebrow. I forgot a step. Eyeliner. <laughs> and I'm gonna put this, I actually put it on my tight line, which is not above your eyelashes, but actually below. And so it looks kind of weird when I have to do it. So I feel like the black helps the brown in my eyes like really pop. And then I'm just gonna put a little bit on my waterline. And I don't go the full way. Go what, three fourths? I usually take some chapstick or like lip gloss and just throw it on my lips. I'm bad with lipstick because I touch my face too much, if I'm being honest. This is my little simple makeup look. When I'm not filming, it takes me at most 10 minutes. I'm gonna take down my hair. Yeah, it just stays in place. I need a... That is my like everyday go-to makeup look. Very natural, don't use foundation because I like my freckles. But if you're ever wondering what I do um, for when I have interviews, uh, usually for photo shoots I'll put on foundation just because of the way the lighting is, but this is usually my go-to look. So, hope you enjoyed.